Hello and welcome back to KM Webverse. This is Kashif Mahmood. In this video, we will see how we can install our WordPress theme using a zip file. We will use this variance business consulting WordPress theme for this example. I have also covered some other tutorials on this channel where we installed Woodmart theme and some other themes. So if you want, you can also check them out. So to install this theme, you just need a web hosting where you have a fresh WordPress installed. So if you want to get the web hosting, you can check out the links provided in the description. I provided some web hosting that I personally use and I recommend them. So you can check out them. So my client has purchased this theme and he sent me that. So now let's see how we can install this theme. So if you own a consulting firm or a marketing agency, then you can choose this theme. It's a good theme built with Elementor so you can easily customize and add your own content and functionalities so when you are purchasing the theme first of all you should see that on which page builder it is built I recommend the themes that are built using Elementor because that's the most flexible plugin nowadays and it's also one of the easiest that you can use on your website and you can easily customize your website you can edit the existing sections very easily and you can also add new sections all the details are written on the theme pages from where you purchase it so just make sure they are compatible with any famous page builder like Elementor other page builders that are used are WP Bakery DV so you can check out on which page builder it is built and make sure that they are easy to handle so that the theme and the website that you build will work for you in a longer term so to install this theme let's go to the website so here i have a fresh wordpress installed so i am personally using bluehost so i have just installed fresh wordpress using that so to install the theme we will go to the dashboard and here in the dashboard we will have to go to appearance and now we need to upload the theme zip file so i will click on upload and here we will have to choose the file that we need to upload before choosing the file you need to just open the folder where you downloaded the theme so here is the theme zip file that was downloaded from theme first so here we need to extract it we will right click on it and we will have to go to winrar and we will have to click on extract files if you don't see winrar option you can just download it from the internet and it, it's a free software that you can use to extract files so just click on extract files so here it is extracted we can open it and here you see multiple zip folders so this is the child theme and this one is the parent theme so child theme is used so that when we update the parent theme or changes are not lost child theme is valuable then you can install it otherwise you can just use the parent theme you can always create a child theme using the child theme configurator plugin i already have a video on that so you can check it out so now let's go back to the website and here we will have to upload the parent theme so here is the parent theme we will just double click on it and we will click on install now it will take a little bit time so we need to wait so the theme is uploaded now we need to click on activate and now we need to go to themes again and now we need to upload the child theme so we will click on upload click on choose file and now upload this child file and click on install now so here you can see it's installed we need to activate the child theme and now we will have to click on this install required plugins button if you don't see this you can just go to appearance and click on install plugins and here you will see all the plugins so just click on install and install all of these plugins you can install them one by one or you can also click on this select all button and here you can click on install and click on apply activate all of these plugins if you are installing any other theme you will see these similar options so you need to install the required plugins in the same way here you can close this startup so here in valiance theme we have to enter the purchase code and and email that we got from the theme forest so here i have entered them now i will click on register theme so the license is activated now we can 
import the demo of the theme some themes you need to enter the license key and it's a must but in some you can also skip this step so if it's not giving you the skip option then you will have to enter the license key you get the license key when you purchase the theme from theme forest or any third party so you have to enter that if it's a must otherwise you can just skip it scroll down and under valiance dashboard we will click on import and here you can select the demo so here it is showing we can select it and here we can select all and we will click on import and just make sure this is selected to yes so all the images will be uploaded and you can replace them with your own and now it will take a little bit of time so we need to wait so here you can see that the import is completed and now we can visit the website so here when you will refresh it you will see a page like this so here we need to set up the home page so here are the home pages design that are available in this theme so you can check them one by one and see which one suits you better so for example let's open this digital agency home page so here is the design for the digital agency home page so here you can check out the design and now let's visit the consulting home so you can just check the design of all of these home pages that are available in the theme and then you can visit the website and go to settings and go to reading and here you need to select the home page that you want to choose so for example i want to use this consulting home so i will select it and click on save changes and now let's visit the website and go to home page so here you can see that consulting home is our new home page now if you want to edit any page you just need to open the page that you want to edit and then you need to click on edit with elementor and the editor mode will be opened in elementor which is a drag and drop page builder so you can edit the page using that so here you can close this pop-up and here you can see that you have all the options to edit them if you will click on this structure button then you will see the structure and here you can see that there is one column and inside that it is showing the portfolio list and if you want to add any more sections you can scroll to the bottom and here you can select add new container and you can add a new container and add your own content in that and you can also optimize the existing one just click on the portfolio list and here you can see the options to edit that are available by, by the theme provider so just close this page and similarly if you want to edit home page just go to the home page and click on edit with elementor so here is the design you can just click on any section and you can update the text from this left sidebar and similarly for this tagline you can change it if you want and here you can change the text of these you can change the button link so just click on the thing that you want to edit and then in the left sidebar you will see the options to edit and then you can make the changes and click on publish so that's how you can install this valiance consulting film theme in wordpress and i have also shown you how you can customize that so that's it for this video like this video leave a comment if you have any question and subscribe to my channel for more related videos see you next time